Good evening from just outside Spartan Stadium here. Michigan State beating Central Michigan today 30 to 10, but this game was a lot closer than the final score. It was just a seven point game in the fourth quarter. Central Michigan giving the number two team in the nation really all they could handle. From speaking to players and coaches on both sides, a little bit of different feeling as you could imagine. Central Michigan happy they pushed them so far. This will definitely help them leading in the conference play despite the loss. While Michigan State happy with the win, but still know that they need to work on some stuff too. We need to show it each Saturday. We can't come out and have a slow half. Um, that just can't happen. Could we have run the ball more effectively? Yes. Could we have thrown it more effectively? Yes. I thought we stopped the run pretty well. They had one run. Could we play better pass defense? Yes. Okay. But we did a lot of good things too. We won the football game going away. And um, in the end, we, you know, that's, that's what happened. We won the game going away. So. I think it's always great to be able to measure yourself against the very best. That was the, best, that was the most fun about it this particular game, you know, uh, you know, exciting to play in this venue, exciting to play a, a program, you know, out of, out of the Big Ten like Michigan State that's ranked second in the country. In the fourth quarter, and we're all just looking at each other like, man, it's right there for us. Um, not much else you can ask for down seven in the fourth uh, against the number two team in the country. As for next week, the Spartans will have their fourth home game in a row as they start Big Ten play against Purdue, while Central Michigan will host Northern Illinois. Another tough matchup for the Chippewas will be there for that game. That one kicks off at 3. Reporting from Spartan Stadium, I'm Tom Eschen, Fox 66.